Hello guys, welcome here, the new video, Jacob here and in today's video it's gonna be about how to work together with your partner in long distance relationship. So I will mention how the long distance relationships become and then what all troubles and pros and cons it brings once you are in the long distance relationship. So guys, have a seat and enjoy this video. I was actually riding a bike, I'm a little bit sweaty, I will just quickly wash my face and we can begin. So guys, the face wash was just really quick, as you could see just in the river and if I can recommend you something. If you have the river nearby and you feel very, very hot, just get to the river, have a bath because there is nothing more refreshing than <coughs> the water in the river. But no more discussion and let and let's go to the topic of today's video so guys the first thing about long distance relationship is how the long distance relationship becomes there are actually three ways how the long distance relationship can begin like the first one is the couple met together they will start relationship together but then there will come a moment in their love and in their life one of them has to go for work for study in college to the other country or to the city so the long distance relationship is made the second one is in the case when some of you are looking for a love online on dating apps and you will find your partner your love partner far away from you but the distance here in this case can be only a couple of hours or even a days of traveling all around the world and the third the third way how people get into the long distance relationship is by total coincidence just like mine case me with my girlfriend gwen when we've met online on a random video chat on omegle so you could see you met there so many people but once you will start talking with someone and you feel really comfortable with each other and then you will like exchange the facebook accounts numbers phone numbers you will start chatting more talking and fell in love with each other <clears throat> so that's the three basic kinds of how the long distance relationships are made or how it happen happens so guys, for now you are currently a long distance relationship, totally new thing for you and what to do now. At first you have to get keen on the distance. The person who you love is not right there sitting next to you, you cannot touch him, you cannot hug him, there is no physical touch. So the main thing you have to find out is the best way of communication you can have. And there is a bunch of different options messages video calls calls uh, the communication through pictures through video sending your partner all the things you want about yourself what are you doing how are you how you feel like telling emotions in the long distance relationship is very important because the person you love is really not next to you and there is no way they could Feel and they could understand what's your feelings so it's really important to find the best way how to communicate with each other get keen on the distance and work together on that once the time passes in the long distance relationship between you and your loved partner you will get into the moment when the long distance relationship will be boring so that's why there is another way you should 
and you have to do is find the activities to do together and thanks to all the nowadays technologies there is no troubles with watching movies online you can do workouts together through video calls you can go for a walks together just outside with while being on a video call there is bunch of bunch of activity in everything what people do there are always pros and cons and long distance relationships are not an exception the long distance relationships can you bring so many good things like uh, in a way better communication because once you are in the long distance you or only you can do is like communicate and what many people found out and me as well like the communication in long distance relationship you can get to know your partner more about the things they love the things they are interested in and the communication is like very colorful and you are trying not to make the communication be boring so you are trying to fight how to end the long distance relationship about your future how was your day everything <clears throat> The other thing what the long distance relationship can bring you is you can get more friends or you can have new hobbies or investments in your free time because for now there is nobody next to you you could spend time with so you are building a relationship with new people or new hobbies new sports anything because now you have more time and now you can focus for yourself but it brings me to the to the side of cons which is connected with getting to know with the new people which is you have to be very careful guys as i mentioned you can meet the new people which means you can meet many girls many boys you can talk with many girls many boys and it could easily end your long distance relationship once you could find someone who is attractive for you and you could fall in love with that person and you could just say to yourself oh yeah the girl is right here with me in uh, my country in my city so I will not have troubles with the long distance relationship and I will end it like no this is not the way how it should be once you are in the long distance relationship and you love that person you can always overcome the troubles and the toxic behavior like I don't have a physical touch with that person in the long distance relationship I will just end it no it's a big no it's toxic and once your partner will mention something like that like you can still work together on it but I don't believe the partner is right for you so guys that was the basics about how the long distance relationship can work of course we could talk about this topic for much more longer time but just generally about the tips for the long distance relationship once you are in the long distance relationship you should agree and make a good way of communication you have to set up time which you will spend together because it always can happen like your time schedule will be different you are in USA your partner is in Europe there are different time schedules so you always have to set up time like maybe on Saturday at a.m. So in your country it's 6 p.m. We will be together on a video call and we will talk, we will do everything. The other tip, make plans about how to end the long distance relationship. Just try to figure out what the possible way you can make, how to end it, if there are possible ways like meet together start living in your country or in your partner's country and just making plans having some making your long distance relationship busy always do something and don't make it be boring because one is boring once it's boring it's very close to breakups and the last and the most important thing love each other guys and be happy together so guys we are in the end of the video i hope you enjoyed it i hope it was at least a little bit informative for you you can use it as an advice for your distance relationship i hope you enjoyed it thank you for watching and 
see you next time in the next video.